Happy New Year! And if you're watching this any other time, happy any time! Today I've got a Pilates Detox and Recharge set. So this is perfect for this time of year or any time of year that you need a short, quick set to get you motivated and get on with your day, get on with all the things you have to do. There's going to be lots of breathing to reoxygenate the blood, rolling and unrolling of the spine to give the internal organs a massage and also get the circulation stimulated. There'll be a bit of rotation as well for massaging the internal organs and squeezing all the stale air out of the lungs. Okay, so let's get moving. If you sit on your mat, lengthen the spine and have the heels in line with the sit bones. Lengthen through the spine, keep the neck in line with the spine. Now hold on to the fronts of your, your shins and then use them to put a little bit more length into the spine. Roll the shoulders back and down, keep wide in the collarbone. Take a deep breath into the ribs, through the nose. Feel the ribs expand, feel your back expand, and then out through the mouth. Empty in the lungs. And again, deep breath in through the nose, feel the ribs expand, and then out through the mouth. Contract the abdominals. Inhale. And as we exhale, engage the abdominals and roll off the pelvis. The shoulders barely move. And inhale back up. So we're just rotating the pelvis underneath as the lower spine moves, but the shoulders barely move. So we're not hinging back. It's a curving of the spine. You're making a C shape with the, the spine. And getting some mobilization into the into the lower spine. Okay, we're gonna take that a bit further. Go to a point of control for you. Take an inhale in, through the nose, exhale, compress the abdominals, lift the pelvic floor, and the pelvis moves first, and then the lower back, and then the middle back. And then use the exhale to bring you forward and up. Inhale, and we'll go back on the exhale. So you can start going as low as you like, but what I'm looking for here is the sequencing of the spine. So the, the pelvis goes like a dial. Click, 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 click. And then use the exhale to come forward and lengthen up. And again, we go down. So go to a point of control and then we'll work up as you get, get used to it. Now lengthen out the legs. Inhale, exhale, pelvis first. We're going all the way down. Arms go over the head. Inhale, take the arms to the ceiling. Exhale, lift the body up, sequence in the spine. Now we're going for this. So, but you can use a band if you have a band or the belt of a dressing gown. Or you can, of course, just go to a point of control for you. And we're looking at the sequencing of the spine. Vertebra by vertebra going down. And then coming back up. Right. Take your arms out to the side, flex your feet, palms facing up. Take a deep breath in and we're gonna go exhale, exhale, center. Exhale, exhale, center. So the hips and the feet don't displace. So we're not moving like so. The spine is like a spiral staircase, spiraling up, keeping the ribs are moving and it's not sort of a arm movement like this. The body is the only thing that's moving and the arms are coming with it. So rotating this way gets the Using the deep exhale, gets the air out of the ribs and come to center. Now, bring your knees in and roll yourself down onto the mat. So, heels in line with the sit bones again. Draw your shoulder blades down with your fingertips towards your heels. Knees will stay firm and parallel. Rock your pelvis back and forth and come to a place in the middle. 
So there's a neutral spice. If you had a bowl of soup on your on your tem on your pelvis, it wouldn't be spilling. Now take a breath in. Without using your bum, use your abdominals only. Spill your bowl of soup over your tummy, and then when you can't move your pelvis anymore, start to engage your bottom, and then roll the spine up off the mat to a bridge position. Knees, hips, and shoulders in alignment. Take a breath in and reach over the thighs, and then exhale, drop through the throat, through the sternum, keep the hips high until the very end. When the lower back touches the mat and roll the hips. We're gonna go up again, breathe in. Exhale, engage the abdominals, tip the pelvis, roll all the way up, vertebra by vertebra, reach over the thighs on the inhale. Now stay here, pick up the left leg, and then just keeping the hips still, we're gonna tap the toe, keep firm in the glute here, and four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Place the foot down, pick up the right foot. Tip your toe, keeping the hips as still as possible, keeping them high. Eight, nine, ten. Now then roll from the sternum, upper back, middle back, lower back, back down. Okay, out, as if you've still got the soup on your pelvis, little ants can pass under your, your spine. There's a little bit of a, a gap here. Place your hands behind your head. Take a breath in and without moving the pelvis, lift your head and shoulders. So there's a tendency to bring the pelvis with you here. But we're going to try and keep it still. And as you exhale, make it tilt the pelvis now, flatten your back into the mat and increase the curve to make a U shape with your spine. Now, open up the pelvis, keep the ribs high, head and shoulders high, and then come back down. So it's a four full full breath coordinated movement so inhale up pelvis stay still exhale create a u shape with your body with your back head and shoulders stay high as you you open the pelvis and back down inhale use the abdominals exhale increase the curve pelvis back to neutral head and shoulders down one more time, inhale up, tilt the pelvis, lift the head and shoulders, pelvis back to neutral, and go down. Okay, so hold your knees, put your knees into tabletop, and start to massage your spine, rolling like a ball. So keep the arms firm, shoulders down, and vertebra by vertebra, so you're not flat backing into the mat. Give your spine a massage. Give the internal organs a massage, stimulating the circulation. And then come up to sitter. Roll back down. Bring your feet into tabletop. Keep your back flat on the mat. Now, if you've not done this before, we're going to do the hundreds. If it's completely new to you, keep your legs like this or even down on the mat. But otherwise, we're going to have them out at a 45 degree angle and lift our head and shoulders. You can find a variation for you that works, but what's important is your spine is supported and flat in the, in the mat to begin with. Take a breath in and breathe out. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, 
three, four, ten. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, twenty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, thirty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, forty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, fifty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, sixty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, seventy. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, eighty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, ninety. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, one hundred. Reach. And bring your knees in, lower your head and shoulders. Oh, that doesn't get any easier. And now we'll roll back up to sit in. Okay. So sit with Z legs. So with the front leg in front, we're going to go towards that side. Arms out. Take a breath in and shift slightly. Put your hand little behind you and then rotate over on the out breath. Inhale, lengthen the spine, roll the shoulders down, lengthen through the, the upper back and curl over and back up. And then just reach over and enjoy this beautiful stretch. It feels so good. Inhale and exhale. Use your abdominals to lift you back up to center. And again, we'll shift and come over, then twist your body. And then as you inhale, lengthen like a sphinx the upper back, roll your shoulders down. And then curl over and unwind. And enjoy oh, the stretch over and back. Change. Your legs, and we'll shift over, come over, twist, push the length in the spine from the base of the spine up through to the top, and then over and up, and again, shift slightly, and then over you go. And then you'll lengthen the tailbone away. So the, the coccyx, you'll lengthen it and out. And roll the shoulders down and stretch the upper spine. And come back. So just reach your arms up. And then back down. Hands on your knees. Roll your shoulders three times backwards. And three times forward. And oh! Yay! Feels so good! Thank you very much. I hope you enjoy. Detox and recharge, ready to get on with all your things. Thank you very much.